You see, God works opposite of our culture's preconceived notions. And what God says to Samuel here, He doesn't just say to Samuel. Did you catch that? He says, man looks on the outward appearance, but God looks on the heart. This is something that we all struggle with. We are all impressed by the appearance of something. We focus on the outward appearance and we miss what is truly important. It's it's easy to do. It's it's natural. It's what we all do. What God says to Samuel, He is saying to all of us that we are fooled and we are tricked when we look at the outside instead of the inside. In our culture today, fame is given to celebrities who look attractive, who are handsome. And you and I both know that by giving fame to people who are merely attractive and handsome has not brought to the forefront of our nation the people with the greatest character. Has it? No, because we have looked on the outward appearance and we have missed what is truly important on the inside. I read in Newsweek some time ago that that most historians don't believe that Abraham Lincoln could be elected today. You know why? Because he looked weird. And he would have been great on the debates. People would have said, man, he's so tall. And he he looks so, he called himself, he said, I'm a gorilla. That's how he referred to himself because he was so tall and lanky. And if somebody said, let's make him our nominee, someone in a back room or some political party would say, oh, not him. He, He looks horrible on TV. But that's the way that our culture operates today. Because we look at the outside. We are concerned with the appearance But God doesn't base His judgments on the superficial. And He doesn't base His judgments on the appearance. God judges the heart and the soul. And I got two applications that I want to make from that, and then I'm done, I promise. 